Hey friends, welcome back for another video. Today is Trenner's 20 month update. So some big things have happened. He's now a big brother. So let's dive right in. If you're new around here, my name is Sandy K. Thank you so much for joining me and I'd love it if you would subscribe if you're not already subscribed. All right, let's dive into the questions. How old is this little boy? I just said he's 20 months old and new yeah. milestones. He's been saying lots of new words like yellow, purple, red, elbow, apple, all sorts of new words. One of his favorite words to say is mama, dada, and touching our eyes, touching our nose daily, and touching baby's eyes and nose, which we have to remind him to be gentle with the baby's eyes or he'll poke them out. And for whatever reason, he also loves saying apple even when he's not talking about an actual apple. Everything has become apple, and he enjoys just talking gibberish and trying to have conversations with us. So we've definitely been seeing him try to talk more and communicate with us. As far as first for this month, he is now climbing up on the kitchen counter. I caught him one day just sitting up there eating bananas, and there was one halved so he could just kind of get the banana and the other ones he just bit the bottom. And so definitely having to move my plants now as he can climb up on our front table and he was uprooting my clover plant. As far as play for this month, like I was saying, he just loves climbing on everything and seeing what he can climb on. We have some picnic tables outside our house and he can now climb up on the bench and then climb up on top of the table. So he's been enjoying that. He now can reach everything well at the playground. So he loves going down the slides and he loves being pushed on the swings for as long as we will push him for. Trenner likes or is loving this month is watching his little sister go on the potty. If you haven't watched other my two week update for baby, we are doing EC early on with this baby, and so he thinks it's hilarious when she goes poop or pee on the potty. Trenner also is very curious and already loves his little sister. Whenever he wakes up, the first thing he says is baby, and he runs and goes and tries to find her and then gives her a big smooch on the head. Another thing Trenner likes is just making people laugh. He was cracking me up a few days ago, just stomping his feet in the kitchen, and I was laughing harder and harder, and he was doing it more and more. So he is definitely loving and making people laugh, and when he was hanging out with his cousins, they were all cracking up at the faces he would make, and he now makes the face on demand, which I'll insert a picture so you know what I'm talking about. But now when we say make the face, he has been doing that face. Things that Trenner is not liking this month is being told no, <laughs> or that he can't touch something, and he's having a big feeling. Things that Trenner is not liking this month is being told no, or that he can't touch something, which I find myself saying more as I'm sitting and nursing the newborn, and sometimes we also a tandem nurse, which I'll get into more later, and he does not like it when I'm touched out and tell him no, that he can't have some M-I-L-K. So that, those are a few things he's not liking this month. As far as breastfeeding and solids go, he is wanting to nurse more now that his baby sister is nursing all the time. We have been tandem nursing, usually just in the morning with sister, and then um, other than that, he's still eating about the same, maybe a little bit less with nursing a little more. But I say up to three times a day we could tandem nurse and then usually I'm touched out at that point and we'll tell him to find another activity. As far as teething and teeth, he has pretty much all of his teeth in except for his bottom canines and those look like they are starting to bulge out the gums but not yet poke through. So we will see when those finally come in. As far as socially, Trenner, as I've been saying earlier, has really been getting along with older kids, like his cousins, when he saw them at a family reunion. 
they were like teenagers and they were he was making them all laugh and just having so much fun having all that attention and he's also been getting along with his dad super well as he's been off work he had like three weeks off with this baby number two so that was super nice okay let's talk about potty training <laughs> it has kind of gone to crap this month as with sleep regressions, I figured since we were three months into it and he was doing super good, was super consistent, that it would be a piece of cake when baby came and it might be a regression for a week and then we'd be good. Well, we're almost going on three weeks being postpartum and Trenner has been having a hard time going to the potty. I will say, now that we're finally home, we were out of town in Utah for a family reunion, so now that we're back, it is getting more consistent. We've had two poops on the toilet the past two days, yesterday and today. So that has been super nice that he's finally kind of starting to let us know like he's not going just straight in his pants like he was doing before. Like literally we were having poops in the pants every day. And so that was really tough, but we've been trying to stick through it and um, he hasn't been signing toilet to us at all, so we've just been basing on timing. I've been doing every hour, and then when that doesn't seem like enough, then I do every 45 minutes to try and prevent all misses, but we're definitely having a few pee misses, so I will keep you updated next month. Hopefully, we're more consistent on potty training again. And sleep are still going very well, which I'll take it. A little bit of regression with potty training and sleep is still good. I think I would rather that than the other way around because this mom is already waking up two or three times with the newborn, so I definitely need all the sleep I can get. So he's still taking a nap around 11, 12. Sometimes we push it back to one just depending on the busyness of the day. And he has been sleeping in till eight or nine since we've been sleeping in about that time. And we've been getting him to bed around 8 p.m. And so to bed at 8 p.m., up around eight to nine. And he's taking a nap about an hour, usually two hours. And he's just wiped out rubbing his eyes even by like 5 p.m. you know having a new sister is a lot of work for this little boy he's been running around a lot more and having fun well that wraps it up for this video we'll catch you next week bye can you say bye bye catch you guys next month <laughs> you say bye you say bye bye